Well, growing up in Hawaii, you were likely to hear stories of supernatural Hawaiian warriors. Those disembodied guardians that marched from the mountains with trails of flickering flames. Distant drums and conch shells warning anyone in their path to run away. Something doesn't feel right. Or cower in fear. The folklore of the night marchers has been told many times. I disrespected the Aina. But two decades ago, a pair of local filmmakers decided to bring that legend to life. It's a weekend for fans of fantasy and myth at theaters this weekend. Tonight we preview A Knight's Tale and The Night Marchers. The original Night Marchers movie sold out in theaters statewide in 2001. Never before had a local film been so unexpectedly successful. And Big Island filmmakers Blake and Brent Cousins followed the film's success with sequels. But now they're back to reboot the legend for a modern audience. 20 years ago, we made this film, and a lot of people are pretty young watching it. Like, they're around 13 years old. Now they're basically adults with children themselves, and they're, I think, going to bring back their memories and bring their children to come and watch the Night March. The film is set 20 years after the original, when a reality film crew heads to Hawaii to hunt for proof of the Night Marcher's existence. And needless to say, they find it. And local audiences are likely to find some familiarity. We watch the audience and we're looking for the actions. And there's one moment in the movie that just people jumped up and it took them for about two minutes to settle down. It was pretty crazy. So we wanted to emulate some of these uh, scare factors. Not all the scares were scripted, though. The brothers and an actor in the film talked about unexplained phenomena during filming. Some of that actually made the final cut. There's a scene in the movie that you'll have to see it, but uh, there's some apparitions that were captured. And uh, when we showed it to some of the cast members afterwards without any heads up, they were like, oh my God, what are we looking at? And they're, you know, the chicken skin was pretty high on that one. They marchers! Basically, our actors on scene were freaking out and that actually added to the film. What you see on their faces this is almost, there is no acting, yeah. they're, they're really playing themselves. That right there was when I got I was like, maybe this is a real thing. Maybe we shouldn't be doing this. And the reboot marches into theaters statewide this weekend. We me. need these shots. Just in time for Halloween. Malika McDonald, KITV4 Island News.